Hello, this is Bern, and if you'd like to learn three immediately applicable skills you can use like today to connect more deeply with men, you're in the right place because that's what you and I will be discussing today. Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life TV.com. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave, and what we'll be discussing today is three immediately usable and applicable ways that you can significantly enhance the depth of the connection you have with men. If this is interesting to you, I'll head up to the first one. The first one is super simple. It's set an inner driven intention before you connect with men. What do I mean by this? If you set, if you set an intention that says, you know what, my whole purpose of this interaction with this human being is I have something valuable to offer and I want to create a moment for this guy. I want to bring some light to him. I want to be fun, I want to be outgoing, I want to be mysterious, I want to be blissful, I want to make him smile from within. If that is your intention, that is incredibly powerful and removes the fear away from you because you're not there to get anything, you're there to give something. When your inner driven intention has something to do with giving something to another human being, that makes you much more irresistible because you don't feel that attachment of things having to happen, of having to have someone do something for you, ask for your number, ask you out, anything. You're simply there because you want to give. People really want to connect with human beings who are there to add value. I'm sure this from personal experience. The more value you want to add to others, the more people will want to stick around you and be with you. Number two is transfer more per unit of energy. This is, sounds complex, but it's quite simple. That means that every time you connect with human beings, Every single thing you do, every voice cue that you have, every movement, every eye-to-eye -eye connection, everything that you do and move and, and how you feel transfers energy to someone else. So if you decide to kick it up a notch, rise up your energy level and transfer more per unit of energy, that means that you can wake up someone who's half dead or half asleep into becoming more of who they really are and show up more fully for you. Now, the key to doing this is number one, you have to be willing to really feel it first. You cannot transfer anything you're not feeling first. So transfers of emotion, my friend, is being able to feel something and get it out there. If you're not feeling it, it's impossible to transfer it. So that's the first one. The second thing is you have to get really, really clear that you don't care what people think about you. If you're really worried about people's reactions off you, then you're going to limit the level of energy that you display because why? Most people live in this beige world that has like four walls around their heart and they can't express more than just the bare minimum that most human beings express. That's a boring, horrible, shitty place that you don't want to visit. So if you want to break out of it, simply be willing to express more and forget about what people think of you. The third tip is incredibly simple, but if you do it, it will make the other two rise to the roof and that's connect with more men. I can't emphasize how important this one is when a new client of mine connects with me and is super excited to work with me and says, you know what, how long will it take me to find my guy? I bring it back down to her and basically reverse it and say, how long do you want it to take? Because if you tell me one year, then, well, you can do it really slowly, but if you want it to happen sooner, connect with more men. Make it happen. If you're doing these first two things and you're connecting with more men, the likability, the ability for you to create this <laughs> is incredibly, exponentially higher for two reasons. Why? Just by the sheer law of averages, you're going to make sure that this happens because you're connecting with more men. It means that one of them is going to be the kind of quality man that you are looking for. But if you're basically connecting with one guy every few months, then you may take years to find your guy. The second reason why this is so important is because when you practice this, when you get the real life practice of this, there's nothing that can substitute that. Uh, you can work it in your head, but when you see that this actually works in real life, that you get some incredibly strong reactions, that comes back to your heart and builds your inner confidence. So next time you do it, you feel stronger because you know this works. When you know it works and you show up more confidently, you get better results. When you get better results, you get more confident. So then it basically is a great cycle to be on. That's pretty much what I have for you today. But before you go, I want to share with you, if you're for some weird reason and strange reason, not already on one of my lists, I urge you and I invite you to sign up below 
there's a program called <laughs> Three um, Habits to Connect to the Man You Want Make This or Less. Something along those lines. Some weird name like that. And it's very powerful, so connect to that one if you're not already in it. If you're watching me on YouTube, uh, I want you to click like on the video, subscribe to my channel, have a comment below, and also head over to the blog where you can connect with me and sign up to one of my free programs. Thank you so much for allowing me to share this with you. As always, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.